Hey guys, well, we're flying solo today because I got this thing delivered and I just couldn't wait for my team to come in and video me doing this. So I'm gonna unbox the Surface Hub 2. Um, so this is out of everything, probably my favorite Surface out of the whole range. It's a really incredible piece of kit. It's not for the average home and it is kind of weird that I'm installing it here in my home office, but um, I reckon that every single boardroom and probably a lot of home offices should have one of these if it's within your budget reach, of course. It's not for everybody. But uh, I've got a bunch of accessories to go with. What I'm going to do with the Surface Hub 2 is mount it on the wall. In fact, this is called the Surface Hub 2S. So uh, I've got a little extra camera for it. That's what's in this little box here. Um, actually can't really use this new camera just at this stage, I think. Uh, we'll see what they do with Teams on the Surface Hub soon. But I've got a wall mount here. So this is a wall mount made by Steelcase. There's a really nice mobile mount from Steelcase as well. So yeah, Steelcase, as I said, they make a really nice mobile stand for this, but there are other mobile stands that you can get as well. And the Steelcase one will soon actually work with a an APC backup battery that will enable you to have a mobile surface hub that moves around with you uh, and stays on power. So it doesn't need to be plugged in. Pretty awesome. So here's the wall mount. It just latches in here with the uh, lugs that will be on the back of the surface hub. So I've got to get this mounted up on the wall. And they really recommend that you do that job with two people and I don't blame them. Um, what I've done is put a plate on the wall because the stud in this wall wasn't really where I wanted it to be and I didn't want to use the supplied drywall mount toggles. I probably could have, but uh, I don't know. I've never used these ones before, so I figured I'd just put a plate. Nobody's going to see all this behind, behind the uh, scenes anyway. So we're ready to put the mounting plate or the mounting lugs onto the surface hub. So, and then we'll lift it into place. By the way, don't forget to get your accessories box out because in this accessories box is, let me see if I can show you that there, the Surface Hub camera, which we'll put on, and also the Surface Hub pen, probably a power cord in here, I'd imagine too. What do you know? Even an Aussie power cord, fantastic. Yeah, if you were clever and you're watching me, you would have figured out that I mounted the whole thing backwards. <laughs> Get the pros to do this, guys. We secretly installed the surface. We just lifted it up and located it on those lugs that are there. It looks really nice on this wall, um, but I haven't taken the plastic off yet. So I'm gonna just find the little tabs there and do the ultimate ASMR healing video. Except I should be whispering. Okay. So there you go, Surface Hub on the wall, ready to go. Probably made it a little bit more complicated than it needed to be the way I installed it, but you probably get some professionals to do this with a device like this. All right, we're gonna bring you a lot of content on the Surface Hub, but I've just turned it on for the very first time, and I'm gonna select actually English US for our setup phase because 
We use the English US keyboard here in Australia because we use a dollar symbol. But uh, we're going to localize this for us here in Australia. Right down here in Melbourne. There we go. So now that I've turned on the device, I've gone through the setup process and I've connected the Surface Hub 2S to our Active Directory, we can now start to use it. And you can see that it's already come up and it's ready to go. So we're gonna bring you some really good videos on the Surface Hub real soon, but I just wanted to show you that we've now got it and that we've set it up, I've mounted it on the wall and we're ready to roll with this. It's a really super exciting device, so I can't wait to bring you more video content about it. If you found this video helpful, remember to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to learn all about how to use the Surface Hub 2S.